Simmons, who is based in the UK, was allowed to leave the West Indies training base to attend the funeral of his father-in-law at the end of last week. As a consequence, he was obliged to go into quarantine in the team hotel upon his return. In an email to board members, Riley wrote, and I quote, I just heard on the radio that our head coach, Mr. Phil Simmons, attended a funeral recently and is now being quarantined as a result. If this is true, I am calling for his immediate removal as head coach. I am being bombarded by concerned parents and members of the BCA. This behavior is inconsiderate and reckless. It endangers the lives of those 25 young men in the UK and in fact the entire management team and cannot be tolerated. The English press will have a feast on his judgment and I suggest we act swiftly." End quote. Nine members of West Indies' 14-man test squad are from Barbados, as well as four of the squad's 11 reserve players. Three fourth players, Shimron Hetmaya, Kimo Paul and Darren Bravo, opted out of selection prior to the series due to their concerns about the pandemic. A statement from Cricket West Indies at the time confirmed that Simmons had gained permission to attend the funeral ahead of the tour. Simmons's movements have been barely noted in the UK press as of now. Joe Root, the England captain, has been given similar dispensation to leave the training bubble to attend the birth of his second child. He will miss the first test as a consequence. Riley's email comes a week before West Indies begin the three-test series in England with the first match scheduled from July 8 at the AG's Bowl.